Hello parents, families, friends, and scholars. This is Math with Ms. Marshall. Today we're looking at Module 6, Lesson 24, Application Problem. I'm going to read the problem first, then we'll read it together, and then we'll figure out our answer. So everybody close your eyes. It says there are eight eggs in the carton. The carton can hold 12 eggs. How many more eggs will fit in the carton? All right, everybody open your eyes. Let's read together. It says there are eight eggs in the carton. So what are we going to do? Exactly, circle how many eggs are in the carton? Eight. The carton can hold 12 eggs. Perfect, we're going to circle 12 so we remember how many eggs the carton can hold. So now our question, how many more eggs will fit in the carton? Hmm, how can we get to 12 if we already have eight? We can grab and count. We can go eight to 10 and then 10 to 12. So we could skip count. There are many different ways that we can figure this out. So let's put 12 as our total because we know we're trying to get to the number 12. Let's draw our tape diagram. So how many eggs do we already have in the carton? Eight. So then what is our missing number? So if you grab and count, how would we do that? Let's do it together. Eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. So how many fingers are we holding up? Four. So what's our missing number? Four. How could we write that in a number sentence? We could do 12 minus eight equals four. Or, which is what we did, eight plus four equals 12. Either number sentence works fine as long as you have four somewhere in your number sentence. So what would our statement be? Four more eggs will fit in the carton. And that's our application problem for today. If you have extra time today, see if you can figure out our bonus problem. It says there are six eggs in the carton. The carton can hold 18 eggs. How many more eggs will fit in the carton? That's all for today. We'll see you next time. Please remember to stay safe and healthy and have a great day.